What's up, YouTube? Happy Wednesday, folks. The big hump day is here. Yeah, it's been a crazy-ass week. There's been a big layoff in my in my industry here in Oklahoma City. Had a bunch of friends lose a, a job. When was that? Yesterday, Tuesday? Laid off like 800 people here in Oklahoma City, all in the oil and gas industry. It was pretty nuts. A bunch of friends and associates lost their jobs and... Yesterday was filled in a bunch of phone calls from them. It's kind of a bummer because in the past I had been through a similar situation where I got laid off of the job of eight years. And I think, you know, I think it was best, you know, just to sit there and let them vent and, you know, kind of actively listen to see how I could lend support. Um, you know, it's not an easy thing losing your job. You know, we put like so much of our identity and self-esteem into our work. It, it, it can definitely be a difficult time, but for me, it was actually my layoff. It was a it was a blessing in disguise, and I actually found myself into a job that paid more for doing less. So it worked out perfect for me. But just tried to lend them a note of an encouragement. You know, if you know anybody or if you have friends that lose their job, you know, make sure to be there for your friends. It's all part of being a you know that's what being a friend's all about, people. Being there for people. But, yeah, enough of the PCA. What is up? We got a package from Aerosol, MMA. This is a doozy. This this package, if I can remember what... I don't even remember what's all in it, but... I know it was worthy of its own video. I got some of Eric's sketch cards that he's made. Very talented guy. Um, also, yeah, let me... I went off on my tangent. I got a couple of TTMs this week. Darren Crookshank was cool enough to hook me up on three. These came back really quick. These probably came back in less than two weeks. So that was really cool. And today I got back from Liz Carmouche. She hooked it up with her uh, Kanji Auto. It would be nice if the camera would focus so you could see this. There we go. She hooked this one up. Dude, the screen's got this crazy glow going to it. I've got some soul glow going on in here. There's another one right here. And for the sparkly card... Ah, shit, I grabbed the wrong one. For the sparkly card, I was like, what the hell? She signed the other two. Why didn't she sign this one? But I guess she thought it was pretty and she didn't want to ruin it. But she signed the back in the black area. So that was cool. So yeah. Another great TTM signer. Liz Carmouche? No. Liz Carmouche. Shout out to all you Lizbos out there that are watching as well. But yeah. Back to the aerosol. Aerosol MMA. I kind of ran out of room right there. So aerosol MMA. A lot of you guys are already following him. If you're not, make sure to. But yeah, there is so much crazy stuff going on in here. It deserved its own video. We pulled off a huge trade. Biggest trade that I've pulled off with someone in a while. Getting some of these cards out of Aer Aerosol's hands was, yeah. He must have really wanted the cards that he got from me because I know how hard it is to get some of his PC cards. He's got a lot of nice stuff. So I appreciate Eric for hooking me up. And damn, look at this bang up job he did on this packet. Damn, we got a wealth of UFC cards in here, folks. going to take me five minutes just to get into the thing. So much good stuff, I don't know where to start. Look at this bang-up job on the packing. Holy smokes, Eric. These are probably all going to be blues and golds. Yeah, these are blue, 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 blues. Hooking me up on some Valor, 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 Valor. Finest Moments Rousey sent some good looking bass. 
What's that? Is that some female MMA in there? There's a blue. That's for my voice. Yeah, that's a, that's all for my needs. This is a pack of female base. If I, this is probably what that is. Oh, sweet. Yeah, yeah. Those are great. Thanks, Eric. I appreciate that. It's great TTM stuff right there. I heard uh, one of DK's buddies got back from Cat Zingano. I sent her out like as that first uh, after we got our packs of finest in from. Uh, whoever the hell broke, I can't even remember. I sent that following week. It was either John or Nick. Oh, man. Kitty cat on a motorcycle. That is the sweetest sticker. Kitty cat on a motorcycle. Kitty cat playing the drums. Kitty cat. Oh, shit. It's a greaser kitty cat. He's wearing a headband. Dude. That's like, um, some, like, bad 80s karate movie kung fu cat. Oh, shit, I ain't even got it on the screen. Key keyboard kitty cat? Dude, kitty cat keyboard. Dude, these are seriously the sweetest stickers ever. Kitty cat... Wow, Greaser Kitty Cat Rally. Where are, where are these from? 19, 1983. What an incredible year for Kitty Cat stickers. All a Kitty Cat wants to do is ride his motorcycle. Dude, Kitty Cat fucking playing, playing the guitar. Oh, I got two. Two of the Kitty Cat. Or wait, maybe it's... Maybe I didn't have two. Yes, I got two. Sweet. Wow. Kitty cat overload there, folks. Rory McDonald, Patriotic Patch from Bloodline. DK got back from Rory. He sent out two years ago. That's crazy that something from that long ago. I guess never lose up never lose hope, you know? When it comes to TTM. I chased this card around Bloodlines for a long time. I saw everybody pull it except me. I was lucky enough to get two of the GSP Patriotic patches, but this is such a sweet ass card, and I finally was able to lock one down. Eric busted a box of Bloodlines, and I had the first pick. Sweet. Yep, it's all on sticker, too. Damn, it's such a sweet card. So let's see what we'll move on to the next pack. Got a big card right on the top. We'll throw it to the back. Looks like these are probably some more blues. He had a bunch of blues that I needed. Blues, blues, blues. Blues brothers. We got a Misha. Everybody gets that on card Misha to 209, 209 from Knockout 13. Johnny Bones Jones. Finest Moments Auto, all on sticker. We got a pretty sharp looking card, too. Daniel Cormier with the sick ass nasty swatch. I can already hear PCP hitting me up. I already got one of these from this set and it graded at a 9.5, so this is probably going to get graded, too. Ruby? Ruby Tuesday? No, it's Wednesday, folks. Ruby Matt Relic of Hendrix. First time I ever looked at Eric's bucket, I saw this, and I was like, since that day, I've probably been asking him about it. It's the 8 of 8, too. I didn't even know that. That's just a nice touch there. That's sweet. Super, super sweet. Oh, and... What what's that? Hendrix printing plate. I didn't know that was snuck up off in there. How gnarly is that? Cause I he he got this. Eric, correct me if I'm wrong, but this is the one that you got from my LCS. He got a smoking deal on this one, and I was like, damn man, I wish I would have known. But yeah, I actually have another printing plate from this, so I got two of them now. So I guess I gotta find the other two. 
Travis Brown. That's such a sweet car. This is the yellow plate. Pretty nasty. Travis Brown's got his work cut out for him. He's got a big, big fight. Big fight coming up. This looks like more bloodlines. We got Brian Stan. Nice looking relic on it, at least. Brian Stan. Joseph Benavidez. Just a little single one. Well, I guess there's a dab of two color in there. Anderson Silva to 88. These are kind of hard to find. Carlos Condit, two color. And Rusamar Palhares. Damn, I totally forgot I hit this. This is the magenta plate. Lots of printing plates today, folks. And I think, yeah, we probably could have saved this one for last, but I'm sure there's probably some still cool stuff in here. It looks like there's more blues probably from my needs list, more blues. And finishing out on a Benson Henderson swatch from KO13. As you can see, another awesome kitty cat mail day. God, how can you go wrong? How can you deny that kitty cat? It says, what does it say on his keyboard? Perfection, maybe? And there's a puzzle on the back, too. Ooh, it looks like kitty cats going Easter egg hunting. 1983, wow. But yeah, definitely check Eric out. Twitter.com slash MMA. You can also, he has an official website of aerosol, www.aerosol, E-R-A-S-O-U-L.com. Check the description for the links below. But yeah, if you see anything that you guys are interested in, make sure to drop me a line. Give me a shout on Twitter, twitter.com slash master trifecta. I'm sure you guys will hear from me before the weekend, hopefully on Friday. Hopefully we can get some breaks or razzes going on tonight because I'm about to turn on the TV for UFC Fight Night. I think Matt Hamill's going to get slaughtered in front of the entire country of Brazil tonight. But thanks for watching, guys. Take it easy. Peace.